going over all the various components for this gasket installation. This right here is our gasket, which will be installed between our differential cover and the other side will be installed on the Dana 25 diff housing. And we're gonna use Permatex Forma gasket number two to make the seal in between the gasket. We're gonna use a torque wrench to torque our bolts between 15 and 20 foot pounds as per manual specs. We're gonna use three quarter inch long, five sixteenths coarse thread bolt with a lock washer and your drain plug will be installed on the bottom of your differential housing. Before you start the gasket job on your front diff, I would make sure that you clean out all the gears in your diff. And to do so, just get some 80, 90 weight GL45 gear oil and we'll just squirt some in there. Make sure you remove your drain plug and that will clean all the debris out of your gears. First acetone the uh, differential housing itself. Make sure it's nice and clean. Acetone the inside of the differential cover. First apply your gasket maker to the surface on your diff cover. Also apply your gasket maker to the surface on your differential housing on your axle. Fast forward here and the gasket sealant is now on your cover and on the diff and now we'll put the gasket on top of our cover. Place your gasket on top of your cover, aligning all the holes. Make sure all the holes line up. And now we will push our cover onto the housing on our diff. Apply your gasket sealant to some of the bolts so we can make sure that the threads don't leak. One note with installing your diff cover, make sure that you install your brake line clamps that hold on your brake line on their front axle. Make sure to align your diff cover in the right positioning, aligning all the holes. And now you just push them together and we'll start at the very top with your brake line hose clamp and then we'll have to put in our bolt. You just thread it all the way through everything. Once you got your bolts all the way through with gaskets, you want to on them, tighten your bolts kind of across from each other, put even pressure on your gasket and your differential cover. The last step for the gasket installation, we have to torque all of our bolts to 15 to 20 foot pounds. The last step is to apply your gasket sealant to your drain plug just to ensure nothing leaks. Finally, thread your drain plug into the bottom of your diff. Torque your drain plug on the bottom. We'll torque it to 20 foot pounds. It's just a half inch drive. And that will just fit right into the hole on your drain plug. That's it. Subscribe. <laughs>